I have a technology pop quiz for you. What programming language has been around for over 25 years and is one of the most popular languages in the world? The answer, of course, is Java. Hello, my name is Jamil Spain, developer advocate with IBM Cloud. And with today's topic, I wanted to get more into the JRE and the JDK, which are usual acronyms you hear when it comes to how do I get started with Java? So let's go ahead and dive in. Now, the JRE stands for the Java Runtime Environment, and I'm gonna abbreviate environment there. And as you can elude from the name, it really means a, a set of software that's there to help Java applications run. Now the components of the JRE uh, include, of course, the Java Java libraries, which you consider them to be more like pre-written code. Writing a little fast there. Next, we'll have the Java class loader. And these names are all self-explanatory, but we'll keep breaking them down. Its job naturally is to take a lot of the Java libraries and load the, them into something that we call the JVM. And the last one, of course, is the Java Virtual Machine, also known as the JVM. And it is the actual engine that actually runs the actual Java code that, that's written. And so these all kind of work together. Although you may receive a Java program, it won't run, or won't understand how to run until you, until you install the JRE uh, 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 kind of libraries to be there. Now you can get these from your usual providers most of the time, any kind of standard uh, uh, editor that you want to use. I know I commonly use Visual Studio Code that has like language packs that can help you get started to do languages like you know Java, Python, Golang, Node.js, any kind of language, any of the requirements needed to be there, this is the primary stuff just to run these, these programs. Now you'll probably hear something else which is called the JDK and that stands for the Java Development Kit. Now the JDK will actually include the JRE And as you can allude, it will give you the additional capability to now create applications as it will actually include something called the Java compiler. All right, so to break this down together, JRE is for running the applications and you can uh, generally to run any kind of Java application, you will need the JRE to be installed. You can get it as a standard operating system, mostly upgrades. Um, it can be searchable that way, or if you're into uh, any kind of particular development, you'll have, usually most editors will have the capability to download these additional libraries. Now once you want to create applications, you'll get the JDK, so you can go and directly get the GRE on its own, or get the JDK, which will include the JRE, uh, to have it there to be available. And that's how the process kind of works. Whenever you start writing applications, you'll start with source code, that source code will have to be compiled. And then the final version there is the actual Java application, the Java program. That you can then distribute to someone else and all they may need is the actual JRE. And this process has to keep coming. As I make changes to source code, I have to compile it. Now I have a program, I run it to make sure it's there. And then I start back over and keep going through this continuous iterative loop to kind of function um, and go. So as one of the most popular languages, this is the exact way to get started. You'll see these two acronyms that come up when you start diving into the Java ecosystem. It is a language that is popular among individual developers as well as in the enterprise space. It's something that's that's always out there and it's a very powerful language, especially with all the, the libraries that are there and the capabilities 
it can provide uh, for you to go. Uh, so with that being said, that's all for today. Thank you for your time. I'll see you next time. If you have any questions, please drop us a line below. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, please like and subscribe.